Wales is a country. Um, so it's one of the uh, devolved administrations of the UK and the, the size of Wales is something like uh, 20 million square kilometres, so about half the size of Switzerland. Uh, the population is 4 million people. Um, they have some cities and some old mining areas in the, the southern part of the country, but there is also a, a large area of mountains and agricultural land. Welsh Water faced a number of different challenges depending on the, the part of the, the utility that we examined. For example, the water resources, uh, people were interested in the average rainfall and how that changed, whereas the surface water management team that we worked a lot with were much more interested in rainfall intensity. We worked mainly with Dwyer Cymru Welsh Water, which was our partner utility in the prepared project. But we've also worked with the Welsh Government um, and Natural Resources Wales, with local um, authorities and developers. Um, so it's been a whole range of stakeholders involved. So as part of PREPARED um, with Welsh Water, we have developed uh, an adaptation planning process. Um, and the process aims to stimulate water utilities uh, to take strategic action to make sure that the activities they're doing and also the assets are more adaptive to future challenges and such as climate change. Um, so we identified four different framings which, uh, which basically represent how adaptation is talked about and therefore how adaptation is acted upon. There are different sort of adaptation actions you can take that will be related to the different frames. Now the frames all act together but they have a different balance. So the market frame you may see as having very sort of economically driven adaptation actions. So that would focus on price, uh, maybe to try and control demand. Whereas the technological frame would look at new innovative technologies. Uh, an environment might be very, very focused on protection of the environment of, over the other uh, frames. So it, it's, it helps you to think about potential groups of adaptation actions. Our work area is called enabling change and um, that is something with the adaptation planning process. Um, we, would, we are hoping that change will happen as part of this process, obviously. Um, but for us it was very important to enable not only change but enable that discussions around adaptation actually took place because that is something that our utility uh, particularly said that these discussions never really happen because you have so much to do every day to take care, care of your birth pipes or more immediate um, actions. So it's very difficult to think about the future. So that's why we developed this process to think about the future in a stru structured strategic way.